Some of you may have seen me walk on a different distro and make, I think, 18 videos about NixOS. And NixOS is a completely different approach. And I wanted to log out in several desktops and I couldn't. So I made myself a logout script. When I came back, another Linux, I said, where's my logout script? <laughs> right? So I have a logout script. It's called Power Menu. And all you need to do is update, right? First update. The new database has to come in because it's already installed this one. This is now version eight. So yes, you can install Arclix Power Menu Git. It's gonna leave the main folder is Power Menu in the .config in the etc scale and in the bin folder and also in the user local bin. So you know what you have to do. Either you do scale or you just get two things there, the .bin and the .power menu and get them to your .config. I rather do it like this because this is a virtual machine anyway, right? So that means it's now working. What is now working? Well, I've overwritten everything and <laughs> I've always the problem. My problem is Azerti, right? <sighs> Give me Azerti, please. That's fixed. Now I think I need to log out and log in. And this bit here, let's see. Azerti, yeah. So. There you go, you've got yourself a desktop, doesn't really matter, right? So I want this package to become something I can grab, copy paste, and on any distro, if it has Rofi, has some, some requirements or we need to have, but otherwise it's gonna be this, Super Shift X, and it will be showing you the menu. Now, this never, it's not implemented, I mean, it's just a menu, so we can actually run it like this, and then you see immediately what I mean. Is that where you go for a logout, a reboot, or a lock, or a suspend, or a shutdown? And lock is linked to a particular file. You can't click with the mouse, you need to click with the enter. It's the i3 lock fancy dual monitor package that's now on our repo. And we have this, this blurry kind of thing, which is quite nice. That's a dependency for this particular package. So if you hate going to type all this all the time, which is good for me when I'm on another release, some, something else, right? And I would just want to have a quick look and then copy paste this code over and then log out, log in and so on. That's fine. But if you want to have this permanent, well, you need to figure out arclinksd.com, choose your desktop, and then decide, okay, I'll have it in left WM. It's in the config. It's in the left WM. It's in the sexy hotkey daemon is maybe the easiest way. You can do it here as well. The sexy hotkey daemon, because we have here control find a, let's get rid of you. Super Shift plus X does not exist, but because that's what we want, right? Super Shift X. Where are the other Super X X? Here. Super Shift guys are here. So basically, rather than saying this, you add something anywhere, awesome, Qtile, doesn't really matter. It's always different, but in the end, you say Arclinux Power Menu. Right, you're gonna do super shift X if, of course, you reload the sexy hotkey demon there or log out and log in. Super shift S should reload it, super shift X, and there it is. So, at this mo moment in time, I've made my key binding. Super shift X is gonna go for this. Now, there's more to tell in the folder. This is the end, right? If you want to get more technical, then you keep looking, right? So we have the power menu. We have, this is the thing we chose, but there's one, two, three, four, five styles. There are, well, 
we're ready for 20 <laughs> of them but I think there are 16 because Control A there are 18 files mine is that one and mine is that one right we have 16 themes and how do you go over them I've made my choice this is my default look and choice but if you want to change there is yet another tool here and that's called power menu right we're talking about power menu power menu change style and then of course you recognize this if you've seen the videos about Hyperland and Wayland we've made something with yet basically I just did a copy paste a few hours work and super shift X style one style two super shift X style three super shift X style four super shift X and my choice super shift X now that's the style but there is also another little thing that's there and we can have well you have 16 million colors to our disposal I mean here you choose some coloring and there are till here 16 I think that we have it uh, so super shift let's put you no I have I don't have <laughs> I don't have my Azerti keys yet I need to copy paste the config anyway um, so just to show then super shift X is this look super shift arc this look this was also a nice one I had to choose right this one black also nice chart choosing is losing more the green department there so a lot of colors this has become the default for me anyway paper also nice chart like I said you have to choose and these other guys are all uh, now one dark so that means that you've got some homework or I will have to uh, will have some work I mean it's ready to be replaced by other colors they're all one dark at the end and um, the point is let's have fun and whoops and um, let's see if we can make some new, more coloring so four are the same as this one here so in due time if you give me colors or some of I make colors will add them as well so that was the idea the goal I was on NixOS and I had problems logging out there was no Arch Linux logout of course not how could I get rid of eh, the desktop I was on and I made a script and hence I moved everything and today I've added the tools to it so the extra tools but once you've set everything you probably will not change anymore all right enjoy the package test it out and um, we'll improve and look at it another day and let me know if you like it all right bye